Hey everybody, happy Halloween. Early, um, this is my second Lee Max uh, Spooky Town video for the year. and Probably the only one I'm going to do. I only picked up a couple houses this year from Michaels. Um, one was the Witch and Warlock that uh, I already did the video on has been up. And I'm, I'm meant to do this a lot sooner. I've been uh, having this for a while. But it is the Michaels uh, Witch's Tower. And this was the second piece. This is the main piece that I really, really wanted after I saw the uh, previews this year. I'm like, that's the piece I'm going to get. That's the piece I did end up getting. Um, I did utilize a 60% coupon to get this uh, back when they first came out. Because uh, these were quite expensive this year. Uh, standard uh, Spooky Town Lee Max house. You know, or a box, I'm sorry. That you would expect. Nice graphics, shows everything, gives you a little idea of what everything does. But we're going to get this out of the way, and then we're going to jump right into the Witch's Tower itself. So let's move this over here to the center a bit. And we're just going to do, before we turn it on, a quick look here at the base. I love this piece. I love Witch pieces. Um, I have a little witch display area. I had to move my display to a shelving unit, so I have different themes going on. Uh, and the reason I had to do that is because my cats were jumping on my big table display that I had everything laid out in one giant landscape. But uh, that's okay because it, you know, enabled me to do different little scenes. But uh, we'll start here at the base. We have a keep out sign. We have a witch. Just tip this a little bit, get some light. You have another witch coming down the staircase. Uh, little tombstone with snakes, skulls, rats. Now up here, on the second level, this actually spins and you have cats and witches that go around in a circle. Up here, you have a witch stirring a cauldron. You have a little takeoff platform. And at the top, this spins, and this is where you have your flying witches. Let me spin this around here. As you can see, everything is detailed all the way around. The power cord plugs in here, and this has the separate on and off switch. Please, and a lot of people don't know this, and they make this mistake. If you use, because this is actually part of a multi-adapter I have that I'm using. Um, when you have pieces like this that have the separate on and off switch, make sure you turn this off before you uh, switch all the power off. When you have motorized pieces, just turning it off at the power switch without turning this off first will damage it. And your pieces will stop working eventually. So a lot of people make that mistake. So let's turn this around. Let's turn this big light off I have here. And let's turn this on and see how she looks. Now down here, you have a green and an orange light that goes on and off. You do have sound. You do have motion. You have a light that comes in through the window. You have the witches that go around. The only thing I don't like is it's very dark here. So, you know, this would be a good part, a spot where you could have spot, like a, with a purple spotlight shining up or something. Uh, that's lit up there. You have a light in the window. And then, of course, you have a green light that shines up on the witches as they fly around. I'm going to turn this main light off. Wait for that green light to come back on. There you go. Really, really cool piece. I love this. As I said, I love my witch pieces. Um, I highly recommend it. Um, 
Like I said, if you could still find them in the stores or next year, I'll almost guarantee that these will be available through other outlets because a lot of times the Michaels exclusives are available as part of the regular line the following year. Um, like the Mad Pumpkin Patch, that was last year. It was a Michaels exclusive. This year you can find it at Menards, you can find it at Pacatans, you can get it online. So if you did miss it this year, chances are you're going to be able to get it next year. Uh, great piece and highly recommend it. This, is, this has been my favorite one this year. So there you go. Witch's Tower, Lee Max Spooky Town. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.